Hey y'all, guy who's just still someone else's intro here, and I think I love video games, so let's talk about some video games today. So what I have on my wrist, I have an Apple Watch, and you can see yourself in there, check that out. But you know what I hate? I'm being able to play games on my watch. It's like, what if I just want to play some games on my watch? I'm like, oh, I can't. It really makes me mad, it really peeves my pebbles, I swear to God. Ah uh, yes, 2014. Tim Cook had just finished showing off the new iPhones when BAM! He bamboozled us by saying we have one more thing. No one expected that, Tim. Right after Tim said this, he showed us the Apple Watch and showed us and talked about some Apple stuff. And he was like, the Apple Watch is a brand new product line from Apple. He was like, everyone was like so freaking out. It was so crazy. A new Apple line product from Apple. It was insane. You know what they didn't show off at the Apple Watch keynote unveiling event? Any freaking games. Now, luckily, over here, I found this great deal for Apple Watch games. I was like, oh my goodness, the Apple Watch games actually exist. I was like, who? All right, check this out, check this out, check this out, check this out, check this out. Oh, 17 games, baby. From the official Apple uh, App Store what listing, it says there's 17 games. Brick Puzzle, Jewel Blitz, Gold Miner, 2048, Sudoku, Egg Shooter, Find Word, Color Lines, Minesweeper, Brick Breaker, Maze Man, Crazy Tennis, Block Ninja, Tappy Bird, Snake, Tic-Tac-Toe, and Stick Ninja. No, that's a lot of games. Us Apple Watch boys went from having no games to all the games in like one second. That would... Whoever made that app, I love you. I'll tell you right now. Tappy Bird is Flappy Bird. Maze Man is Pac-Man. And Brick Breaker is just Breakout. So there's already three games that have been copied off of here. The only games they're actually allowed to have here is Snake. Not Snake. Is uh, Tic-Tac-Toe and Sudoku. So those are only... There's only legal legal games they should have in this bundle here, so, I mean, I don't know. I mean, yeah, this app is a bit weird, from the presentation of the menu to select the games to just the, how the games work in general. I didn't have the, I don't have the sounds from the games in here, but just know, these games have, like, the crappiest and weirdest sounds I've ever heard. Now, Tappy Bird actually sounds like Flappy Bird, so, I mean, that's a plus, but other than that, these games are just all weird, and they, I mean, they just all seem like weird clones. I mean, I know that you're not supposed to, like, want to find the original of these games on the app store to play on your watch but like just the just the way these games are presented it's just really weird i don't really like how these are presented at all they all just have this all weird vibe to them like uh the pac-man one did and snake which is coming up in a second they just all have this weird vibe to them i just hate them all how they're all presented and like they all just have like the weirdest pre presentation to them all right now if you won't mind me i'm gonna game a bit real quick all right, what should I play? I should play some Tappy Bird. Ho, oh. oh, ho, oh. ho! Dang, I died. Oh, man, I just want a game. I'm sorry, I think gaming on the Apple Watch isn't such a good idea. I mean, just the games are just really bad and crappy, and like you have this small screen to play them on. So that's why I think I'm just gonna stick to gaming on a console. Oh, man, I wasted a dollar ninety nine. <laughs>